Hello everyone, this is Elias5891. Welcome back to another Katane tutorial. Uh, this time we are going over half of the uh, Math is Hard pack. This is the Emoji Math module. Uh, I will go over the Needy uh, at a later date. Uh, this one's, once you see it, it's usually not too bad. Uh, just a big communication test. Uh, we don't need any edge work. So, here's the module. It's got a whole bunch of emojis, a whole bunch of smileys, frownies. You know, em emojis. That's that's what they are. Uh, so, as the diffuser, you're simply going to read them to the expert. So, in this case, you would read... That's up to you how you do it. I like to read this one, for example, as equals, close parentheses, open parentheses, equals... Minus, equals, close parentheses, colon, pipe, or bar. I think most people use bar. So, expert's going to jot that down. And each symbol is, except for the pluses and minuses, each symbol is two characters. So just split them into two character sections. And look them up on this chart. So we have equals close. That's right here. That's a six. Boop. Boop. Uh, equal, open equals, that's a seven. Boop. And colon bar, right below it, that's an eight. So 67 minus 68 gives us negative one. So we, expert, we tell him back, negative one. So, negative 1 equals. Let's do another one. Uh, this one's a 2 by 1. So I'd read this one, colon bar, colon bar. Colon bar, colon bar, plus open equals. Open equals, there we go. So, colon bar is 8, colon bar is 8, plus uh, open equals is 7, 88 plus 7 is 95. 9, 5, enter. One more. Bar colon equals close parentheses plus bar colon, close parentheses, equals. Bar colon is 9, equals close is 6, oops, 6, plus bar colon is 9, we already said, close equals is 3, 96 plus 93 is 189. One, eight, nine, equals. Module done. So, that's how you do emoji math. Now, there is one potentially tricky bit about this one. So, to demonstrate this, let's go ahead and pull up another one. Uh, 11 modules. Let's make sure we find one that I'm looking for. Da, da, da. Screens for my eyes only. Pull up the bomb. Lots of emojis here. There we go. And do we have what I'm looking for? Yes, we do. No. Yes, this one. So looking at this one, <coughs> colon, open, colon, close, minus, close, colon, colon, close. You know, notice now I've kind of dropped saying the word parenthesis. Some people say it, some people don't. <coughs> so we look this one up, colon, open is four, colon, close is zero minus 
open colon, or no, close colon, sorry. Close colon is 5, colon close is 0, 40 minus 50, negative 10. So we've got the answer. Now let's look at this one. Notice there's no, um, no clear button. So let's say we make a mistake. 1, 0, and then I don't get down to that negative, but I hit 0 again. I'm like, uh, I don't know if I hit 10 or 100. I'm going to hit the negative just to be sure. And you can hit the negative at any time. It doesn't have to be the leading character. So right now I've entered 1, 0, 0, negative. So I have negative 100 as my answer. I'm going to get a strike. OK, it's reset. No, the answer should be negative 10. 10, make it negative. Well, why did I get a strike this time? An odd little quirk about this module is w the when you get a strike, it resets the number value, but it does not reset whether or not you've given it a negative. So the first time I hit, so it took that answer to be negative 100. Got a strike, so it was like, okay, we've got a negative. Then when I hit 10 negative, it gave me the answer 10, but it flipped the sign again from a negative to a positive. So if I actually looked at my uh, output log on this one, it would show me that I inputted negative 100 and then positive 10, which is obviously not what I meant to do. So if you get a strike and you've hit the negative key, remember that you've hit the negative key. You don't need to hit it again. Negative 10. Uh, but really, that pretty much sums up uh, emoji math. Uh, if you have any comments, questions, concerns, suggestions, feel free to leave them down below as always. And until next time, this has been Elias. Uh, thank you very much for watching. And have a great day, and don't explode. Also, don't overflow this one, because apparently you can break it.